Good morning, Internet. Welcome to First Thing in the Morning, the only show where we roll out of bed and start playing some games. Video games. Mm. All right. So recently I've been on a Sega kick. I've been playing a lot of Sega Genesis games. You guys seem to enjoy it. The views are up. Good times are being had. People are high-fiving each other in the streets. So I figured I'd just keep the good times going. Continue with our little blue mascot here, Sonic, and his heterosexual life mate, Tails. We're going to play Sonic 2 today because Sonic 1 was a, was a lot of fun. So we're going to play the first, I think it's six zones for this video. We're going to stop on uh, Mystic Cave Zone, which is the last zone I'll play for this video. And then we'll come back tomorrow and finish it off. But before I start, Heisenberg needs hasn't been on a couple episodes, so she needs her spotlight. Look. Hello, everyone. Subscribe to First Thing in the Morning. Thank you, Heisenberg. Completely unforced <laughs> shout out there. All right, so nonsense aside, let's get right into the game. And hopefully it is less soul-crushing than my Sonic episode, which I never beat. It still haunts me now. I'm sure one day I'll go back to it and defeat it, but that's in the past now. Let's look towards Sonic 2. Now this Sonic has Tails, which I don't like. I don't mind that he's in the game, I just don't like the character. Um, I don't really have a real re I think it's because of the cartoon. I think that's why I don't like him. And all the weird fanfic. Um, which is just weird. So, weird obsessions with, um, you know, weird furry obsessions aside, though, Sonic is a is a pretty good game on uh, on the Sega Genesis, anyway. I'm not talking about the 3D Sonics. But the 2D Sonics like this were always a lot of fun. And there you go. 49 seconds, we got through Act 1. Yeah! And I'm not sure if that's a continue. Yeah, okay, it's a continue. So... Now this is kind of a, I wouldn't say a rehash, but it's very similar to the first level in the original Sonic game. As the game progresses though, you get more unique environments and stuff, so we'll be getting into that shortly as I speed through the hell out of this level. Because it's got those magical boots, and it can go so fast. Oh guys, you can't even handle that blast processing. Can't handle it! And there you go. Now we're going to fight the evil Dr. Robotnik again. Because apparently the Sonic development team can't be bothered with thinking about multiple boss fights. You always have to fight the same one. In a different vehicle. I'll give him that. They, they gave him a different vehicle. Let's look at him. Who wouldn't want to beat this guy? This terrifying mustache that for some reason reacts when he gets hit. Coward! Alright. So there you go. We're off to uh, all our little animal friends are being freed. And we're off to a tremendous start. Sonic doesn't look too happy. He's kind of bored, apparently. Alright, chemical plant. First place I'd look if I was looking for a hedgehog is a chemical plant. Don't know why, but that's what video games taught me. And we're going the other way. Alright. No! Oh well. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> I don't know if there's like a pit down there, but if there is, I just got really lucky. Yee! That was a manly scream. Okay, let's get a head start. I wanted to checkpoint more than- oh yeah, that's true! Now Tails just isn't, uh, he's not completely useless. He, he can collect some coins, as I saw earlier, he can damage the boss for you. So, I mean, he's not completely useless, he has some benefits to him, I guess. I think the cartoon- I think honestly now I'm thinking about it, it's the cartoon that, that ruined Tails for me. I don't- I don't remember disliking Tails when I was a kid. And I also think there is, there's a little bit of resentment towards Tails, because when I was a kid I, I had gotten a cat and I wanted to name him Tails, but I told this to one of my friends, 
and he got a cat, and he went and named his cat Tails, so it, he ruined it for me. So I think I, I took my real-life hate and applied it to the character instead of to my friend who I should have been hating all these years. I should hit him next time I see him. I'll film that and put it on the channel. Views through the roof. Oh my god. Well that sucked. Crushed the little blue bastard's head. Man, I wish when I ran my my feet and legs made perfect circles. Wee, wee. I don't know why I would want that, I just it looks cool. And I think I would be able to freak people out at parties and stuff. So this so far is the... Sonic is really at his best when you just kind of let him... You don't put anything in front of him and you just let him run. That's always the parts of Sonic I like the most, which always confused me why there's so many... Well, there's always a water level in Sonic. But I'm getting a little ahead of myself. We'll get to that in a little bit here. My issue with Sonic and water levels. Look at that. I'm so fast the screen can't even keep up with me. Even Sonic is too strong for the blast processing. Oh dear. See? Water. Again. Purple water. Why? Your whole concept of behind your character is to go fast. So you put him in an environment that slows him down? I know this shouldn't bother me, but it does because I'm a giant nerd. anything else to be outraged about right now. But this is 2016, and there always needs to be some outrage out there. Holy shit! So, um, my outrage is, uh, the water level in Sonic. Which, if you think about it... Oh, son of a bitch! <sighs> See, now that's annoying. Why would they put... You know what, I'm not even going to ask the question, it's just going to upset me. So I'm going to take this slow. Here we go, here's a good idea. Let's design a game where our mascot is renowned for his speed. But let's put some areas in the level where if you use that speed, it'll kill you. That's completely fair. That's not cheap deaths at all. Alright. Pissing and moaning aside, boss level time. Now he's gonna drop this container of water on me or whatever it is. I'm assuming it's water. And I have to... Well, there you go. Tails beat him for me. Thanks, Tails. Alright. So. It wasn't without incident, but we got through... We got through this godforsaken level. Too, and I'm our, I'm, I'm at, and my heart rate's already through the roof. I think I need some. I think I need some like aquatic run. Oh, there's more water. What is this? Sonic the Hedgehog goes to the beach. Why is there so much water? You can't run in water, Sega. No wonder you went out of business. Although the Dreamcast was a kick-ass console, and never got the love it actually deserved. But I'm not speaking to Sega right now because of all the water levels in Sonic. But there doesn't seem to be, it just seems to be waterfalls here so far. So I can't hate on them for waterfalls. There you go. Let's put the blue hedgehog in some water. I don't get it. It just doesn't make sense to me. It's like if Mario... There, I said it I said it right for all you American watchers. Mario, because every time I say Mario, like a normal person should say it, uh, I get comments on Twitter and on Facebook about it. So there. For all my American viewers, 
I said it the way you guys said it. Say it like as if you get head trauma after the M. So Mario. But I digress. It's as if Mario couldn't use, couldn't jump on things. You know, it's like if every enemy in 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 Mario in Mario, I hate saying it like that in Mario, um, had spikes on their back. Like the the, the the spiky turtles and stuff. If every enemy had that, that would be the same thing as putting Sonic in water. It doesn't make sense. You're wasting a mechanic. And I'm getting a little bit too worked up for my own bit. So, I'm going to calm down and enjoy the game. So, here we go. Plus, there hasn't been that much... <laughs> I really know why I'm complaining about this level. There hasn't been that much water in it anyway. But they keep doing that. What cheap... There's, there's some cheapness in this one that wasn't in the first Sonic. I think. Where am I going? Going the wrong way, obviously. Whee! Uh-oh. There you go. Heisenberg is here to calm me down. Jeez, of air! Everything is so slow and painful. Come on. Yeah. Yay. Okay. That wasn't cheap at all. Let's just put enemies right at the top and give you absolutely no chance to avoid them. Not cheap at all. Another boss? How many bosses? How many times do I have to beat this guy? So now he's going to club these statues with his giant hammer. And I have to climb up and bop him on the head like that. Haha! <laughs> Tails got hit. Take that, Tails! Alright, so it's, as you can see, it's a pretty simple fight. Um, I can't imagine anybody failing at this. If you failed at this boss, leave a comment, I want to laugh at you. There you go. Save more of our little- Ah, little penguins with toques! Haha! <laughs> I love penguins with toques. I mean, I love penguins, they don't have to have toques, but if you put a penguin and a toque together, what's not to love? What are you doing? Alright, so we got a bonus life. Ooh, it's casino night! Alright. Time to hit them bumpers. Oh, I missed the giant... I want points. Yeah. So we're gonna give it one shot, see what I get. Oh no. No! No! <sighs> see, that's why I don't gamble. I lost everything in one pull. <sighs> I'm not very good at gambling. Mostly because I don't like wasting money. Unless it's on fun things like video games, then I'll waste all my money. Economy 101 here on first thing in the morning. Oh, shit. How many of you are actually paying attention to what I'm doing? And how many of you are actually paying attention to the cat? That's what I'd like to know. Uh-oh. Upstaging me, this one. Upstaged by a feline. <clears throat> Alright, so we're gonna go in here. I don't get what the point of those boots were. Whoa, dear mama. Whee! The cat is licking my arm, and if you've ever had a cat lick your your hand or, or whatever, you know that they are, they have little sandpaper tongues, and uh, it's, it's a little distracting, to be honest. I'm having a little bit of trouble here. Hopefully it doesn't kill me or anything. Alan, now she's biting me, which is definitely... Can you guys, are you guys catching it? Maybe you can see it. Look at her. Look at her! She needs them, she needs them human salt. Oh, now she's okay. So now she's just lying down. It should be alright now. The distractions seem to have ended. So we're smooth sailing again once again here on the show. No uh, feline distractions. 
pussy always getting in the way. Am I right, boys? Am I right, guys? Ha <laughs> I, I, ha! Sorry. I, I apologize to maybe the one or two girls that might watch this show. Oh, uh, no, not again. That was an accident. Okay, well, at least I didn't lose anything. Whee! I don't honestly know where the fuck I'm going. Uh, I'm just trying to move right continuously, and hopefully that pays off. And it did, because I beat the level. There you go. As you can see, Heisenberg is absolutely thrilled about my performance so far. Right, Casino Night 2. Because Casino Night 1 simply wasn't enough. Alright, got me some... Got me some rangs. Ooh, what's that? One thing I will say about this level is that I know I, I'm I'm kind of fuck. I'm blowing through it. Um, but it looks like there's multiple paths. It looks like there's not just one set path. It looks like there's tons of different ways you can get through the level, which is always cool. It's always fun to kind of come back to a game and realize that, oh, look, this old game has a bunch of new things I've never seen before. And I feel like this is a really good example of that. I just did it again. I died exactly the same way. Einstein's definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over again and expecting a different result. So apparently, according to Mr. Einstein, Sonic the Hedgehog has made me go insane. And of course, I'm sure there's people that would argue that I've been insane for years. But those people are unreliable. And I... Oh well. I should have just done that right from the beginning. Just drop. Oh. Okay. That works too. That's the one thing about um, Sonic, well not just Sonic games, but since I'm playing Sonic, that's what's coming to mind, is uh, the unpredictability. You never kind of know if there's a pit, if there's a floor beneath your feet. Oh great, and now they gave me the ability to go even faster, so what could possibly go wrong? Huh. Now that looks more difficult, so we're going to go here. Alright, more rings. Oh, don't go back. Now I'm just tempting fate. Alright. Tons of rings. I think I've re I've re I've changed my stance on uh on gambling. I think gambling's a great thing. And Tails collected a ring and got me an extra life. Which is good, because the way I'm playing right now I'm gonna need them. And it doesn't help that Heisenberg is licking my thumb. That really isn't benefiting me in any way. Is this one the Yeah, that's what I thought. You have to This boss is tricky. Especially since Uh Great. 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 Oh Heisenberg, I didn't make it. I died again. Alright, so we're going to try that one more time. I'm going to be more careful this time. Whoa, stop. Stop your nonsense. The problem with this one is that you can't hit him from underneath. So you got to kind of <laughs> somehow find a way to not get too high so you can still see him. Or, in my case, get lucky a couple times. That works. See? Like that was kind of lucky. Ah! I need that ring! Yes. Trying to go for some, yeah, ninja moves. Whee! 
even though I know I, somebody's watching this right now and going, you idiot, you're doing it wrong! Screw you, I beat it. Couldn't have been doing it that wrong. <laughs> Alright, saving more animal. How many of my animal friends did this guy take? Little pigs! Little birds flying away. The pigs were cute. Dancing around and stuff. Alright. Well, um... Casino Night 2, or Casino Zone, whatever it was called, was a nightmare. So now we're at the hilltop. Which, in the uh, town that I grew up in, was a strip club. So fond memories of the hilltop for me. The only strip club I've ever been to. I never went to another one. Because look at me, do you really think I need to pay to see boobs? Especially since I started first thing in the morning, girls come up to me on the street and say, Hey, aren't you that guy from the YouTube show? And I say, Yes, I am, ma'am. And they say, I want to show you my boobs. And I say, Go ahead. That may or may not have happened. Um, but if you guys believe that it did, that'd be cool. That would help my fragile male ego. <laughs> Alright, so the non-strip club version of the hilltop is going rather well so far. Of course. Right into the lava. At least I had a shield. Whee! At least I got one ring. I feel like there should be a secret there, but there isn't. Oh, the music in this zone is, is not very good. I don't like the music in this zone. Overall, I, the music doesn't bother me that much in Sonic, but this zone... Yeesh. Ah! Fuckers. Fuckers. Man, I want to play as Tails and just fly through every level. Just fly above all the danger. Screw you guys. I mean, if you had the ability to fly, why wouldn't you use it, right? Uh... What? Ah... Uh, that was kind of bullshit. Whee! Right. See, I'm not only playing this game, but I'm supporting the cat's head. Because I like to multitask. And she's so cute! Every time someone watches this show and doesn't subscribe, Heisen for cries. You want to make this cat cry? Are you really that heartless? You should subscribe to the show. Every time you don't, Heisen for cries. How dare you? You're a monster! Oh shit! He didn't die. There's so many, so many secret things you can find in the Sonic game. It'd be nice to watch someone with actual talent play this, playing this game, like like a speedrun or something. That would be cool. I might have to look that up. See what the world of Sonic speedruns look like. Oh, sh <sighs> ah! Okay, well now I feel better. Of course, now that I get it, I probably won't need it anymore. But I'm gonna keep moving. Stupid tails. <laughs> oh, come on. Bitch. Whee! Alright. So we're 
getting, I think we're getting pretty close to the end now. Wow. Didn't realize I'd be that. Oh. Alright, well we got some decent hits on him off that first round. And, no. Oh, awesome. Sweet, Tails killed another boss. And he's not as useless as I remembered him being. Is that eagles and what was that, monkeys? Seems like an odd mix. I feel like the eagles would try to eat the monkeys. What is this? Where am I supposed to concentrate? Oh, Mystic Cave Zone. Are we already on the last part of the... Damn. Alright. Well. further I progress in this game, the less familiar everything seems. So... Ow! Hold on. Goddamn cat! Driving her claws into my hand. You ever try to control a blue hedgehog while a cat licks and bites your hand? I'm gonna walk in the park. So, if anything, I should get bonus points. I love the way Sonic jumps off when he's holding on to something. It's ridiculous. How he maintains his holding on to something pose. Whee! Nope! The potential of getting crushed in this game ah, always affects me. Oh, right, made it to the last. Whew! Beat the level with 120 coins. And a cat constantly. Look at this, she hasn't stopped. Oh, and as I say, she hasn't stopped, she's had enough. Get out of here. Get out of here. Damn cat. Watch my performance go through the roof now. Oh. <laughs> I'm so glad there wasn't a pit there. That would have sucked. Hey, look at my performance. Dies. You don't usually want to call attention to yourself when you fail. Oh, normal people. Oh. Oh. Sweet. Man, they really don't want you to take any damage in this, in this section of the game. Oh, shit. So we're gonna keep going. I've pretty much been invincible this entire level, so... Nothing but good things to say about this level. Oh, I hate this one. Of course, the second I'm not invincible anymore... I fail. Oh, Jesus. Whee! I love those little trampoline things. I wish I had them in my house. I, I don't really know where I put them because I live in an apartment, but... That, that doesn't matter, okay? It doesn't matter, I just want things. It doesn't matter if it's practical or even really ah. necessary. And another shield. 
Checkpoint. Yeah. We're gonna haul ass. Is it boss time already? Apparently it is. Oh, this boss is really easy. He's gonna come down from the roof. And then get this. Well, you have to wait till he puts his spiky spikes. And I think you can hit him on the way back up, too. Which is easy mode. Alright. So none of the bosses are really that ah, difficult in Sonic. Um, I find like they're even easier in this one than they were in the first one. Um, but... Sometimes it's nice to just be able to... Oh, sometimes it's nice to just be able to beat a boss. You know? There you go. Alright. So that was... Act 2 of the Mystic Cave Zone. Which marks the... We're gonna come back. We're gonna pause it because we're done here for today. Uh, so that was it. Those were the first couple zones of Sonic 2. We're gonna come back tomorrow and hopefully finish off the game. I don't know if I've ever beaten it. I can't remember if I did or not. Uh, so we'll have to wait and see till tomorrow to see if I can beat it. If you enjoyed this video. Now it's time to take care of a little business. If you enjoyed this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter, on Instagram, at MTL Broski. Join, or, I mean, sorry, like the Facebook fan page, facebook.com slash F-T-I-T-M. And a little side project. I, 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 in case you haven't noticed through these videos, uh, I'm kind of a big wrestling fan. Uh, so I do write reviews for uh, WWE SmackDown. They usually go up on Wednesday nights, I mean, sorry, on Thursday nights before the actual show. Uh, so if you want to check that out, make sure you visit kfabetoday.wordpress.com and look for anything written by at MTL Broski. Right now I'm just doing a SmackDown review, but there's possibilities of different articles in the future. So go check that out if you like it. Um, let me know. If there's something you'd like me to write, write about in the world of wrestling, let me know. Or if there's just a game you'd like me to play for you guys, again, let me know. So with so for today, that's it. We're done. Go home. Get out of here. Go do what you got to do. And be sure to come back tomorrow right here on First Thing in the Morning. Thanks for watching.